think this was how things were going to go when Sentinel came in? How's it going? I'm good. But listen, I need to show you something. Over there on the table. Recognize him? Yeah, his name is Victor Cost. He's old school black ops. My guess is he's here with the CIA. Well, if he's a mole, then he might be able to help us. From what I can tell, his location is somewhere near the channels. You might want to start by looking there. All right, I'll head over and see what I can dig up. This was a good find. Glad I can help, even if I am all dinged up. Drones! Drones! They're gonna put this thing on drones? I know. I know. The ghosts are doing everything they can to stop it. How's your pal? Holding up. Thanks for looking after him. You heard anything about a Lieutenant Colonel Walker? That the guy that works with the troops call themselves the Wolves? He used to be Skeltech's military advisor. Heard he was an operator. You know him? <sighs> yeah. Yeah, we met a couple times. You got a mean look in your eye. You got big plans? You know how I can get off this island? Right. And leave us regular folk to fend for ourselves, huh? Auckland is 2,000 kilometers away. It's an awful long way to run with your tail between your legs. I'm not running, Mads. The USS Wasp is a couple dozen clicks off the coast. If I can get there, I can come back here with some help. The Wasp, huh? Not sure I'm fond of the idea of a bunch of squids running around our island. Well, there are a couple of jarheads on board, too. Well, if that's the case... Look, I'll be straight with you. We know that we're no match for former spec ops. So some of our friends, homesteaders and Skell employees both, are leaving the island on a couple of boats. Can you get them protection on the Wasp? Absolutely. All right. I'll tell you where the boats are. What were we? What were our lives? Part of a test run? 
Looks like that's all we are to these bastards. No. My life will not be a test run for genocide. I'm gonna demand Schultz calls a meeting the second that tear is in our veins. We need to discuss how to make Sentinel hurt for the pain they've caused. Right there with you, brother. We'll make them pay tenfold.
Don't hurt us. Please. I'm not gonna hurt anyone. Mad Schultz sent me. You don't look like homesteaders. Well, I worked... I work for Skeltech. Mads is a friend. When Sentinel started arresting people, he helped us out. Why did he send you? A chopper got to this island from a Navy ship just a few dozen clicks off this coast. I can get these bolts back to that ship, then I can come back here with help. <laughs> well, <laughs> certainly sounds better than taking a boat all the way to Auckland. <laughs> what happened to your chopper? I'm still working that out. You leave it someplace? <laughs> yeah. Maurice Fox. This is my daughter, Harmony. It's nice to meet you. Call me Nomad. You know, we, we met another soldier. He said his name was, um, Hill. Josiah Hill? Is he here? No. Uh, he helped us get around some of Sentinel's men, but he was injured. Well, I mean, not, not, not badly. We left him at this uh, fishing building area thing. I actually think I know what you're talking about. I'll pick him up after I get back. Guys, everyone take cover. What the hell was that? Give me a minute. My God. Those people. It, it, it must be a, a, a new security program. Holy flying cow. My guess is, my guess is nothing could come to or leave this island as long as it's on. That must be what brought down my chopper. I want to go home. Me too, kiddo. Listen, you have to get these people, and you have to get out of here. What? No one is coming to save you, and there's no ambulance on the way. You have to run. You have to get to Air One. OK, yes, yeah. Uh, are you coming with us? I'm gonna find my friend Hill. That fishing building you left him at was a fallback point. There may be other soldiers. Good luck. 